pasta like this only in five-star Italian restaurants, now I prepare it myself at home, it is very delicious and quick to make. The first thing we will do in this recipe is to cut a quarter of a red pepper into julienne. We will continue with our recipe, this time cutting a quarter of a yellow pepper also into julienne. And finally, we will do the same with a quarter of a green pepper, so that our recipe has a lot of color. Now, we will take half a white onion, and we will cut it into thin slices, just like I am doing. Remember that if you don't like onions, you can skip this step. And then, we will cut half a peeled carrot into julienne. Then, in a large pot, we will bring enough water to a boil over high heat. And meanwhile, we will cut a stalk of celery or celery into thin slices. Now, we will take a medium chicken breast and cut it into small cubes. Just like that. We check our pot. And once the water is boiling, we will add a teaspoon of salt and mix. Then, we will add 150 grams of long pasta, whichever you prefer. We will cover and let it cook for a few minutes until it is ready, or al dente.
Meanwhile, in a frying pan, preheat a drizzle of olive oil over high heat. And then we will add the chicken that we had previously cut at the beginning of the recipe. Season with salt and pepper to taste and mix well with the help of a silicone spatula. Then add the onion and carrot that we had previously cut and continue frying over medium-low heat. And also incorporate 50 grams of broccoli already cut. We will continue frying and add the yellow, red, orange and green peppers that we had reserved. and then include half a tablespoon of white sugar to give it more flavor. Also add three tablespoons of soy sauce. It smells delicious, right? And then incorporate 100 milliliters of water and continue mixing everything very well. Now add the pasta that we had previously cooked. And let's mix everything until the ingredients are completely integrated. Just like I'm doing. Ready. Enjoy delicious pasta in the best combined Italian and Japanese style. I assure you that you will love it, plus it is very easy to make. Remember that if you like this recipe, you can follow us on our Facebook page, where I share easy and delicious recipes every day. Bon Appetit!